Hey guys, welcome back to Jamal Rule 16. I am your host Jivon, and today we're about for a brand new benchmark. As you can see, we're testing out Sonic Origins for the Nintendo Switch. That's right, today we're testing out the Yuzu emulator on my Intel Core i7-4790 with the AMD RX 570 4GB VRAM graphics card. We're running with 16GB of DDR3 RAM in dual channel memory mode. And honestly, right? I'm scared about this music being copyright, so. I'm actually going to disable that. But anyway, to get the game to run, you actually have to disable multi-core CPU emulation to get the game to run. Otherwise, it will crash at the menu screen, well, the opening cinematic. I'll actually just do a video showing you that as well, just point blank showing you it and it running. But yeah, other than that, the game will run. I am getting some graphical glitches right now. I don't think the audio is working the best. Actually, I do think it's working pretty good, but I'm going to mute that because I'm not sure if this is copyright or not. And I have no time for that crap. <laughs> you know what? I think it's fine. I think it's fine. It's fine until it's not fine. This is being recorded on a capture card, so keep that in mind. No cinematics look copyright. copyright. I don't know, man. But this is a way to play the new Sonic Origins that just released today. If you guys are interested in that, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget, please leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, and stick around for more epic content. Yeah, the music gotta go. I don't, I don't, it sounded fine. I'll put it back on one more time just to let you guys hear it. Yeah, it seems fine. But I ain't playing that game with Sonic. I, ain't, I just ain't playing that game with Sonic, man. I just ain't. It seemed like it was going fine. But hey. Like all classic Sonic games, that this takes me back. I remember dying here over and over because I never really liked Sonic. <laughs> Nonetheless, I hope you guys enjoy the video. If you guys like seeing me test these emulated games on the channel as soon as they release, guys, so you get to know right away if you can play it or not, hey, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. It really helps me out on the channel. Other than that, we're like basically a low-spec gamer over here. We, pay, we test a lot of low-end games on integrated graphics and whatnot, which I imagine would run on this pretty fine without any issue, obviously, because it's an old thing, right? So I don't think there's any issue with that, but yeah. Once again, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I'll see you guys next time. I'm just going to have some fun with this and play this a bit. And I'll see you guys next time. Yes, I will do the video exactly showing you it launching and everything once I disable multi-core emulation. I think it actually may come before this video. So stay tuned for that. I'll see you guys again and just enjoy the rest of the gameplay.